Hello, today I'm going to show you how to use Visible Thread to quickly create a starter compliance matrix with just a few clicks. So we're going to navigate here to our issuing doc. This is just a sample SOW. It's a regular PDF file that we've uploaded to Visible Thread. We haven't done anything to it, haven't changed it, haven't edited it. We've uploaded it into the Visible Thread environment just as it would have arrived. And now just to show you, this is just a regular PDF document. We'll open it up here. And what the compliance matrix is going to do uh, is it's going to save you time versus manual copy and paste, which can be very time consuming to go through an entire document, find your requirements, highlight them, copy, paste. Uh, very laborious, very time consuming to go through and manually check all of these things. So I'm going to show you how Visible Thread can automate this process and save you a lot of time. So it's as simple as this. We're going to click our Create Compliance Matrix button here on our Summary tab when we're looking at uh, our SOW. This is going to bring us to the Quality Analysis tab. And now at this point, you can see the words that Visible Thread is looking for in order to create a compliance matrix. So we're looking for words that indicate a requirement, words like shall, will, must things like that. So if we click on Will here, we can see how Visible Thread is actually going in to our document and analyzing uh, the content and pulling out the relevant information. So here on the bottom, we can see every instance of Will that appears in our SOW. So we want to create a compliance matrix for our entire document. So the way to do that is just to click our green button here, Create Compliance Matrix. We're going to hit Generate Matrix. And now we have our entire document shredded, placed into Excel format, so it's very easy to edit. And we have highlighted all of the terms that were previously uh, defined in the screen you just saw, our will, shall, must, our terms that, require, that imply a requirement. And those are highlighted here in red, along with the section that they appear in, in black text. Now you can see that there's some text uh, which is black and some text which is gray. And all that uh, illustrates is the black text is a section where Visible Thread has found a keyword that it's looking for uh, that was provided in our dictionary that we used to create the compliance matrix. The gray text is just the section where the software has not found one of those keywords. And that's not to say that the gray text can't uh, include a very important requirement, uh, because it certainly can. If we scroll down here to row 52, we can see that they're telling us the contractor shall support the following objectives, and then they give us four objectives. Now, we flagged the fourth one because it has that word provide, but these other three are still important, um, so that's something we're definitely going to want to look at. And since the compliance matrix gives you the entire text of the document, the entire text of, uh, of the SOW in this case, you're able to easily see any requirements that may appear, uh, but that may not be highlighted uh, by the software. So this is a big time-saving value. Um, it can cut down your compliance matrix creation um, by hours and uh, free you up to spend your time in more uh, useful and productive ways. So that's uh, how simple it is to create a compliance matrix in Visible Thread. Thank you very much for watching.